Hey guys and welcome back to Fisher Cat. In this episode, we are going to be doing another showcase. Guess what harpoon it's going to be? I mean, you probably know by the title of the video, but we are going to be, you know, showcasing the Trident Harpoon. It's only 600 gears. Okay, 30% penetration bonus on large fishes. It's a very fast way to fire. Are you sure? I don't think it's... Oh wait, it's already faster than the Saw Harpoon MK2, which is maxed. So, the rate of fire is a lot better than the maxed Saw Harpoon MK2. But all of its stats are super low and I'm not a big fan of it. Yep, it's very low. But hey, we can just check it out. The Trident Harpoon equipped it. Okay guys, we are going to be using Tiger because large fish's spawn rate is a lot more better. But the penetration is what matters. So I'm not going to be using Tiger. Good thing I actually, you know, remember that. So I would use Biscuit, Biscuit as well. I mean, technically because Biscuit has no extra perks or qualities or talents or specialities so i'm going to be using biscot biscat so to test out the okay so far um, i don't like the speed of the harpoon penetration is really hard to even catch these small fishes look at that i can't even catch a small fish look at this okay i'm trying the snow fish okay i missed it snow fish it's not even one shotting a snow fish what about a dory <laughs> Okay, firefish one shot. Okay, pina pirana pinara. What is a pinara banana peel? It's pirana. <laughs> okay. So Nemo, Nomi, whatever that is. Okay. The small fishes penetration is is a one shot mostly because uh, the fishes which I'm one shotting is mostly from the ocean caves and the coral reefs. And as I said in the last episode, the penetration of the fish or the hardness of the skin of the fish technically increases gradually as you go from the coral reefs to Catlantis. So yes, the penetration is really bad. Okay. Here, yeah, look at this. Let's try catching this radish fish. Uh, okay, two shots. That's not so bad because... And another thing you have to actually consider that it was actually found in the ocean caves and that's pretty close. So it kind of varies about which area or which, re which region you're kind of, you know, trying to fish with this harpoon. So, okay, let's try the sunfish maybe. Let's get these small fries out of the way, please. Get out. Okay. Sunfish, one shot, two shot, three shot, four shot, five shots. That is extremely bad because the catting harpoon can one shot it. And I'm pretty sure that even the saw harpoon can one shot that. So yes, that was pretty disappointing. Okay. The speed. Okay. The rope length is pretty damn sad. It's really sad to just see the rope length. It just ends here. You can't even go up so much. Look at that. You can go only from here to here. And that's... Very bad, you know. You really want to catch fishes, right? Which, you know, spawn here as well. Because what if an oxygen fish spawns over here? You really want to catch it. And you have to, you know, be able to get your rope length so far. So, okay. So, let's uh, leave Paradise, which is Catlantis. I mean, Catopia. And let's go upgrade our Trident Harpoon to the max. And see how it holds. And see the difference in qualities. And, um, you know, to see if it's worth spending the money on it. Here we go. Okay, as you can see, the perks are not increasing too much. The oxygen cost did not increase. The penetration increased a lot. I'm happy about that. The rate of fire even got better. And uh, the speed is pretty good. Rope length is... Uh, it's okay, but it's not as better as the Harpoon as well. And as you can see, I mean, I'm not comparing with the Mia Rocket Harpoon. Because the Mia Rocket Harpoon is kind of, you know, unique in a sort of way. So, I'm going to be comparing it with the Catling Harpoon and the Saw Harpoon. Uh, the penetration is a lot more better. Wait a minute, is it better? No wait, the penetration is bad. Rate of fire is bad. Speed is is better. Rope length is better. A little bit better than the Catling Harpoon. So, let's see how the Trident Harpoon MK2. The Max holds, uh, you know, the name MK2's Trident Harpoon. And especially, it's, it's called a Trident Harpoon. So, it's technically should be the, you know, the most OP Harpoon in the game. But, it's not. So, okay. Okay, the speed is a lot faster. I love the speed. I love the distance as well. I mean, it's not... You can't get the last part of the screen, but it's pretty close. So, it's, it really doesn't matter. Speed is really good. Really good. I like the speed. I like the penetration as well. The penetration increased a lot, honestly. Look at the second. I can one-shot an Inga and a Lassie fish. That was good. Okay, let's try a puffer fish. No, that's bad. Puffer fish, I mean, puffer fish is are hard to catch when they're inflated, so... Okay, let's try the snowfish again. 
before the snowfish took two shots but now the snowfish is uh can i get the snowfish please okay wolfish two shots maybe okay two shots that's pretty good actually the catling harpoon get one shot the wolf wolfish wolfish i mean okay where is the snow okay the snow one is gone okay let's get these guys out of here i want to try the tuna wave which is wave six if i'm not wrong okay pengler one shot nice i like it okay let's try the ice fish ice fish one shot two shots three shots actually it would have got it in two shots but because they were fishes in the way it was not able to do that but you know okay let's try the cowfish okay one two okay two shots cowfish is actually two shots so that's pretty good crystal fish should be a two shot right i mean crystal fish should be a two shot when it's not inflated but when it's inflated it's pretty hard to catch because your harpoon just bounces off yep crystal fish is two shots as well and that's really good so the penetration of this harpoon is pretty good speed is really good reload is pretty good as well the speed is pretty fast okay as we okay wow i actually one shot at that crystal fish okay that's cool tuna one shot two fishes that's insane the penetration is really good i mean honestly the harpoon before upgrading was horrible very bad oxygen cost is doing really well back in 100 percent anyway okay the tunas are pretty easy to catch it's like just like a one shot kill and that's really fascinating so that's cool i would say this harpoon would uh, tend to do well till cv region but after that it would kind of be uh kind of underrated it would be pretty bad not underrated i mean it would be pretty bad in terms of performance uh but i'm gonna try to showcase uh you know trying to catch one of the big city fishes in catlantis with this harpoon so we really need to survive so long so we got to use uh, you know lila because 30 percent oxygen efficiency which is really essential so yes okay let's uh, go on to the catlantis and um, i'll see you when i find the big three okay guys as you can see the big one of the big three has uh, appeared and i really need to stun him just to you know increase my chances of catching the fish so yes we can see how fast it holds as well three four i don't know how the count is i'll probably write it after editing i mean during editing actually okay is it possible to catch it though come on come on trident harpoon don't let me down oh no we got to get rid of these jellyfishes come on come on trident harpoon come on oh my gosh it, it takes so many shots dude it's taking a lot of shots come on come on big three the saw harpoon couldn't do it but can you i mean pretty much i think the saw harpoon couldn't do it because i had no oxygen and i had no you know enough time to actually you know keep shooting at it but now this one has a lot of options and as you can see it is faring very bad <laughs> yeah by the, by now if i used the catling harpoon or the meow rocket harpoon i would have definitely caught that fish but it's pretty insane to catch come on i like the speed of it and uh come on come on oh my gosh it's taking so many shots guys this is looking really bad for us <laughs> i mean really bad for the harpoon actually because the harpoon's value is going down because it's really kind of not effective in catching this fish come on just look at the number of shots it takes to catch one of these fishes man it just takes so long so it's kind of impossible to even try to even imagine catching the leviathan with this i mean unless you are an expert so yeah probably if you are an expert you can technically try catching the leviathan by with this but i would say it's kind of impossible because it's it can barely catch a big three and uh, my cat is about to die <laughs> and the big fish is just gone okay here it is okay i'm gonna use the electric bomb because i don't okay pretty close okay the leviathan is back but as we know we are not going to be able to catch it but hey i'll try i mean yeah might as well try right Boop. pause button hit me okay 2500 coins uh, bye bye coins yep it's technically impossible to even get one part of this uh, leviathan because man 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 it took so long to catch one of those big three dude ah oh, that was pretty bad come on come on Oh no, yeah, these I don't know how it's going to face against. Oh, look, it can't even reach that far because the ro rope length is pretty bad. So, yep, it's very difficult to get through these waves because, you know, it's really, you know, it, the speed could be a lot more faster. The distance, it can't even reach these. Look at this. It can't even reach these uh, eels. So, yes, catching the Leviathan with the Trident Harpoon is impossible. I mean, 
it could be possible but you got to be really efficient i guess i don't know man so with the titan harpoon i would say it's a, a pretty good harpoon up till cv region because in the glacial region it's kind of hard to catch catopia i mean catopia is a uh, general so you can use any uh, harpoon in catopia because i don't know jellyfish is as well so i would i would not recommend buying the trident harpoon the saw harpoon mm, it could it, it it could be good for its rate and for its worth because uh, the saw harpoon is pretty essential and pretty okay till the glacial uh, region or the area but i would say go go for the big guns you know the big guns in the sense of mia rocket harpoon the catling harpoon or even this fish cutter harpoon the fish cutter harpoon actually is actually a pretty good harpoon actually as well i probably might do a showcase of it in the future so yes uh, i would say by the last three harpoons are the best harpoons in the game because you know it it makes sense because more you spend the more you know better the harpoon is so yes and that was it for this episode guys if you had fun please subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next episode uh, bye bye